We have that awesome includes a fan expo. Dragon We're going shopping. lady in the food area has a dumpster full of coleslaw. She's putting it on those wraps over there. We're leaving Costco now. It was a madhouse in there. There was a lot of people today. Um, and it's really hot, like 100 degree weather hot. <sighs> I hate this weather. Hear that, guys? Hear that? that is the sound of pure heaven. The AC is so nice in this heat right now. Isn't that right, Maxie? Next stop, Winco. Cart dog, cart dog. The feline canine little cat dog, cat dog, cat dog. Alone in the world was a little cat dog. picked up some thick cut bacon. It's gonna be so good when I cook it up. I can't wait to make, hopefully I can make dinner. I want to tonight. As we're leaving Winco just now, they gave us free water as we were exiting the door. They're so nice. On a hot day, cold water. Who could ask for more? That's right. Winco is a hundred percent satisfaction guaranteed. Successful day, Mom. Yeah. Thank you. And that you were there to lift everything for me. Yeah. Thank you, Austin. You're welcome. Is it you? Is it me? Say it's us. And I'll agree, baby. Jump in the Cadillac. Anything you want. You deserve it, baby. You deserve it all. I'm gonna give it to you. As soon as I get home, I have to go straight to karate. So, that whole karate, karate thing, going to karate tonight, um, karate was good, and as usual I wasn't able to record anything at the dojo, because I was too busy training. But, um, I always like going to karate, especially on, like, 
Thursdays because um, there's black belt class and the instructor's class. And we just get to sit down and talk about, you know, how to run a class and stuff like that. But um, my karate master, he he always has something interesting to talk about. Or he just brings up something like really something that gets stuck in my head for like makes me think on something and tonight he said we as human beings like to attach to tragedy like I don't, I don't know how this came up but like we're I think it was about like we were trying to discuss how to teach a class of like karate students like younger kids or whatever and how to um deal with like a situation where one kid was like really sad or something and he always gives us all these like different situations on how to deal with the situation and like uh move like change the mood and move on with everything really quickly, but he said that we tend to attach to tragedy more than we attach to victory or something. I have to agree with that pretty strongly because, like, uh, like I'm guilty of that, like... When bad things had happened in my life, I tend, or like, first off, I just dwelled on everything, and everything sucked, and it's very depressing, but like, once I, like, disconnect from that situation, or I like, don't think about it, or move on from that past experience, or whatever, I feel so much better. I'm pretty sure I've talked about this in the vlog before. I just have just worded it differently about like moving on from negative things because negative things like definitely causes stress on your body and mind. And you need to just focus your mind and just move past this hard difficult, bad, sad situation and, you know, improve your life from that point on. So, yeah. Now, I know not every situation in the world is you're able to just walk away from and just remove yourself from it. So it doesn't apply to everything, but like you're, in your mind, you can escape from things just for a minute or so like take a nap or something but yeah this is all I got for you guys today I have to go work tomorrow um hey I have karate also tomorrow and I'm debating on if I should go to gy the the gym after I do work tomorrow it's kind of all up in the air, and I'm also talking to Shane to see if he'll be available to go to the gym tomorrow. So we'll see what happens. I think it might be very, very close, very tight quarters on managing my time tomorrow, but um, tomorrow might be a uh, brutal day for me. Like, I think just work working out at, at the gym and karate is just going to kick my butt. Like, I'll have no energy by the end of the day tomorrow. But that's my plan for tomorrow. So we'll see how it goes. So thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time.